Honey. Honey. Yes, are you okay? Are you fine? Yes, I'm fine. I, I, have you seen my brother? He's not here yet. I, I think... He's supposed to be here to come with us for the appointment. That should be him. Oh, he's here. Uh, good afternoon, brother. You let yourself in? Uh, yes, sir. I, I used the spare key, you know. I thought you and your wife would be in the bedroom. All right, it's fine. Can we go now? Oh, yes, of course we can. Yes. Um, careful, let me help him. Help him. Um, Nancy, what can I do for you today? The last time I and my husband were here, you mentioned something about him improving on his sight. Oh, yes, that is true. He's really, really improving. He's doing great. I want you to do something for me. Okay. I want you to give him a medication that will make him never get his sight again. I'm sorry, what? Yes. This is some money here. If you need more, just say the word and it is done. All I just need you to do is give him something. I don't want him to ever get the sight. Hmm. Um, but just this once. Mm. That's fine by me. Okay. I work on something. Thank you, doctor. I wanted to come and see you first before he comes in. Oh, no problem. Thanks. Thanks. Um, since when, Mr. Ray? Since when what, Doctor? Since when have you fully gained your sight, Mr. Ray? Uh, that was, um, two days ago. Two so days ago? Yes, you said if I keep up with my medication, I would regain my sight. Yes, definitely. And that's great news. So, why haven't you told your wife? I understand why I haven't told her. Why is that, if I may ask? Because I had a window. The window? Yes. Just look through the... Wow, Mr. Ray, I'm so sorry about that. But what what will you do now? I will just keep pretending until I uncover the truth. Hmm. Sounds like a good plan. I need to go now. No problem. Let me see you also. Yeah, we'll have to. Careful, careful. Watch, watch your step. Watch your step. Um, doctor, uh, how is he doing? Well, I must say his improvement is quite slow. I think I might need to recommend more medication for him. Uh, doctor, is there any hope for my husband to see again? <sighs> there is, but the chances are quite slim. <sighs> but we're doing our best. We are. All right. Thank you, doctor. You're welcome. Uh, thank you, doctor. Um, You're welcome. Brother, I want you to be rest assured that we are behind you. You have our full support. I can tell you that you're going to be fine. Okay, you don't need to worry about anything. Please. Thank you, Henry. I am sorry for being a burden to you and Nancy. Uh, no, honey. No, you're not, okay? Look, I promised myself I'm going to stick with you through thick and thin, okay? I'm not going anywhere. Hmm? 
Mr. Ray, I must say you do have a very supportive and loving family here. Thank you, Doctor. We have no choice. Um, Mrs. Nancy, please, can I see you for a moment? Inside? Yes. All right. I actually forgot my bag, so anyway, okay. I'll be right back. Okay, so we'll just wait for you guys in the car. Um, so, Mr. Ray, you had a document for splitting your company share. Your wife will receive 60% and your brother will receive 40%. Oh, thank you, lawyer. Um, You're welcome. Brother, what are you doing? You know, since the doctor said my chances are slim and I do not want the company to falter, so I trust you and Nancy to handle it. Thank you, sweetheart. Don't worry, the company is in safe hands, okay? I will make sure that everything goes smoothly. You won't regret it. Wow, brother. This is really unexpected, but I, I appreciate it. And um, I want to use this medium to promise you that I won't let you down. I'm going to take care of the company, your property, everything that belongs to you. Thank you so much for this great opportunity. Okay, so please, you need to sign here to finalize the transfer. Also sign. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Game over. What, what's the meaning of this? Yes, Nancy. Because your game is over. What are you doing here? Welcome, doctor. Welcome, officer. Uh, so, brother, you can see them? Yes. In fact, I have been seen quite clearly for the past three weeks. Uh, uh, honey, you've been seen for the past three weeks? Yes. <sighs> but you, you didn't tell me. Um, <laughs> I swore an oath to give the best medical care to my patients. Um, doctor, how bad is it? The truth is, it's really bad. I mean, I could try to get some medication from the pharmacy, but we can only hope. Okay. You see the money I gave to you earlier? It's just the tip of the iceberg. Once I hit the jackpot I'm aiming for, consider all your problems solved. <laughs> all right, no problem then. I'll send you my account details. Ah, sure. All right, thank you, doctor. You're welcome. My bag. Oh, of course. Thank All you. right, see you. Well, he has actually regained his sight for quite some week now. And the medication I actually gave to him were just medication to help him improve his sight. Wait, doctor, you set me up? I did not set you up. I just helped my patient to see the darkness he's living with. Thank you, doctor. You know, it hurts me to see my own blood brother sleep with my wife. Honey. Honey, are you okay? You, you left me alone in the living room. Oh, I, I thought Henry would keep you company. Wait, he's in his room. I'm sorry, I, I actually dozed off. Oh, okay, um, do you want to come to bed now? Yes, honey. Oh, all right, this way. This way. No, 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 this way, babe. Oh, okay. Mm. Oh, ah. Sorry, just uh, relax. Let me... Go to the kitchen and get water for you, okay? All right, thank I'm sure you. Sure, you must be tasty. I'll be right back. All right. Now.
Nancy. Nancy. Babe. Babe. She left me alone in this house. Babe. came down to the sitting room to continue their nonsense. Honey, please. Honey, please. I am so, so sorry. You are not sorry. You are only afraid of facing the consequences of your action. Honey, please. I am really sorry. Please. Brother, please. I am very, very sorry. We can actually sort this without involving the cops. I please, do not want to hear a word from you. You do not have the right to call me brother. As we speak, I do not want to ever lay my eyes on you again. And as for you, we are done. I'll ask my lawyer here to prepare the documents for our divorce. I do not want to set my eyes on you again. Officer, please take them away. You both are under arrest. Anything you see or do will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to a lawyer. If you don't have one, the state will provide one for you. Please move. Get out. Brother, please. I, I, I'm, I'm, really, I'm really sorry. Move it. I am sorry. Please, please forgive me, brother. Move it. Brother, please forgive me. We can actually sort this without involving the cops. Please. Please, please. Move it. Brother. Move it. Move it. Move it. Doctor. Why? It's fine. I'm just glad you're okay, and I'm glad you came to the hospital. Um, I should say the name. Thank you. All right, Mister Ray. I'll prepare the necessary documents needed. Thank you. I also take my leave now. Hi guys, thank you for watching that very interesting video. If you enjoyed it and you learned something from it, please do not forget to drop your comments and please like the videos. Thank you so much for always supporting Mosi Studios. We love you.